of you who noticed, last week we missed our vlog. Now we didn't mean for it to happen that way, it just kind of did. Now while it's not completely uncharacteristic of us to quit something like this in our lives, we wanted to assure the viewers that this won't happen again. In honor of that, we decided this week that we're going to share everything that we've quit in life. So I guess when I was 13, I quit Hebrew school. The violin. Well, technically I graduated Hebrew school, but I stopped studying Hebrew. The thing with the violin at such an early age, like in like the third grade, is nobody, nobody should have to be forced into playing an instrument in the third grade. There's no way that's gonna stick. One of my first jobs I ever had was a busboy at a pretty shitty restaurant. Technically, I owned a bass guitar. The job didn't last more than about uh, five or six months. But I never played it, so I don't know if that counts. I used to play golf. I played Little League Baseball for a while. But honestly, who the hell has patience for anything like that? I remember this one time this kid hit a fly ball when I was playing center field. And I caught the ball and I was so proud that I caught the ball that I just stood there with it. But the entire time there was a kid on third base. He tagged up, scored. You know, one of my best seasons in wrestling back in high school. I was 7-2. and two. If you were a kid and you grew up on Long Island, you played soccer at some point. So, I decided that was my last year and my best year. But I hated soccer. I would, I would kick and scream until they pulled me off the field. So when I was in ninth grade, I joined the track team. Technically, I quit track too, but it was more of like a, it was more of a retirement. Uh, in ninth grade, I quit the track team. Call it a retirement. I retired from track. I told myself that this year would be the year to eat clean and healthy. I was kicked out of band in like ninth or tenth grade. I'd say that lasted for about two weeks. Since then, I really didn't have much of a reason to continue playing the drum. Thank you. 